Let's look at the scalar interface for extra trees. Overall, the interface for the extra trees is really similar to what you've seen before. We have this extra tree classifier. We also have a regressor version of this. You can easily import it. I'm just going to talk about some different points here. Right now, we have this an estimators parameter here, which controls the number of random trees that we want to learn. And overall, all standard options are still available, such as the splitting criterion and the maximum depth, so you can adjust those. And right now, as we have a random process, you can also set the random state for the repeatability of your learn model. And we also have a quick note here, as Learn implements this slightly different than what you've seen. And we don't have control on the number of random choices because we just have one per feature with this library. Now you have it. Don't forget to use this on your final project.